Um, this is um, a picture at the top of the steps, if I'm not mistaken. Um, that's a wall that's to your right, that leading into uh, the right there, a little farther to your left, where you see the bedroom. <clears throat> that is, um, if you're at the top of the steps and you take a um, a left um, and go all the way down the hall, there's a bedroom back there that's like a like a workout room, if I'm not mistaken. Um, and this is in that room. Um, and I just took a picture of a door that was in that room. Three seven three. Just another close up of that. Three seven four. Um, picture of the blood that was in the area, the largest amount. Three seventy five. Just another picture, same area, just different, a different angle, closer up. Three hundred seventy six. Um, same area, just different angle. It's different angle, same area. That's a, a little bit farther down the wall from that area. Just another picture, different angle. Um, this is back um, at the beginning of the steps. Um, we were starting to take uh, or put tape up to, for measurements and things. And what's the purpose of putting these tapes up to obtain measurements? Uh, for one, to see just the distance of uh, how high the blood is sometimes. Um, or you can tell by the distance or the, the angle of how a blood hits um, a surface. Same thing, just a different photo. Same thing, different photo. Um, here I'm just putting a closer um, ruler just to show measurements of the angles. Same thing, just different picture of the angles. Closer up. Just another closer picture. Um, this picture is kind of a, to show a, a little bit of a distance um, to kind of get the whole blood stain pattern in. Can you repeat the question? What if any significance does that number two have in advantage? Um, it looks to me like a like a cast off. Next picture. And what are you doing here, sir? Same thing. Just taking a um, a closer measured picture of that. Uh, Previous picture, but just in a smaller frame. All right. Um, that was the same um, blood stain pattern, just the the tail end of it. I guess you could say. Uh, this is on the uh, I guess the hallway, closest to the the bedrooms. Um, just getting a measurement of, of how high the blood is onto the walls. Next photo. I think where we're just taking a picture just to show how high from the from the floor. Um, here, just showing the the length of the blood droplets. Same thing, just showing angles 
and measurements. <clears throat> this is back in the um, the workout room. Um, I think we measured off the highest amount of uh, blood that we, the farthest up that it went or we could find. And again, just for clarification, this is after the initial crime team has been through the residence? Correct. I, I had come, uh, I think it was a day or so or a couple of days afterward, me and um, Captain Park to just take more pictures of, of the scene. Okay. Next photo. Just marking off measurements. Next photo. Um, just trying to give a, a visual of, of what is what we were seeing I mean it was it looks busy because there's a lot of there's a lot of cast off there's um, in, impact spatter so we were just trying to get overall pictures of everything next photo sir this photo uh, we were just taking measurements um, and showing the it looks like could be um, Smearing, so like maybe blood transfer, a lot of movement. Next photo, sir. Um, we were just showing the height of the window. Next photo. <coughs> Um, here we're trying to show the angles of uh, the blood droplets. And which, and which direction they're going. Um, the tail of the blood droplet, blood droplet tells you the, the, where, it, where it was going. So a lot of the times when we're putting these these um, measurements, we're just trying to show you the angle and which direction it was going. And using the screen before you, um, if you could mark on there where, what you're talking about with these tails. Mark on it? Yeah, you should say her. Okay. Um, we, I'll use this one right here because it's, it's the largest one. Um, I'll use this one right here as the ones I'm. I'm you could speak in the microphone. I'm sorry, I'll, I moved away from it. I'll use this one right here as the one I'm referring to. Um, the way the blood droplet hits on the surface, um, you can look and tell by the the angle which way it was going because the tip, the tail, will tell you that's where it was going. So it was going this direction. That doesn't really. If that makes sense. And if you could go into the top right hand of the screen and go to the clear button, sir. Top right, the clear. Yeah, just did a little green arrow at the top. Tap that on oh. the menu. And then scroll down to the bottom left. And there. Huh. Easy. Thanks, sir. Uh, next photo. This is uh, where we were taking uh, swabs, DNA swabs of certain areas. Um, when we do this, we'll take a picture of the swab next to